Today, we are diving into the world of offline mobile gaming with a list of the top 10 new offline games for Android and iOS in 2023. Whether you are looking for an action-packed adventure, a brain-bending puzzle, or a relaxing simulation, we have got something for everyone. So this video is gonna be crazy and let me remind you to drop a like on this video and subscribe to this channel. This is Jasper and let's begin. Starting off with number 10, Bare Knuckle Boxing. It's a high quality and visually spectacular sports game about bare knuckle boxing. You will definitely like not only the picture but also the excellent implementation of the animation of movements, strokes and so on. There is also a full fledged career building, own sports empire as well as the presence of a huge number of athletes which can be trained, improved and put up for battle. This and much more including management that requires honed and timely actions provide intense but extremely addictive gameplay he's killing him with strikes he's killing him with strikes <laughs> nice left hand. moving on to number nine river city girls the plot of the game revolves around a situation that becomes chaotic on the dark streets. Two strong heroines are storming this town to save their boyfriends and no one can stop them. As you fight and fight throughout the city, you will gain new skills, increase your strength and use weapons that hurt and destroy. You will unleash different types of weapons including combos, throwing opponents and special attacks that make bad guys cry and beg for forgiveness. So it's a fun game that is designed in an impressive pixel art style. On number 8, Exist. It's a new RPG with vivid graphics, a smooth control system that promises to bring a new breeze to the action RPG game series. The game will test the player's operation and skills but don't worry too much, all the operations are relatively simple and there is a design specifically for mobile phone operation. The position and timing of walking are important concept in the game and you need to explore them in the game as long as you use them flexibly, you can play freely and galope on the battle. Field. Next over at number 7, Trial Riders. This one is a simulator of motorcycle racing taking place in three-dimensional locations. Players will go through stages overcoming obstacles and performing tricks in the air and obviously barrels will explode in front of them while the motorcyclist flies over the abyss. As you progress through the levels, players earn starts maximum 3 per stage and upgrade the characteristics of their bike. In addition, it will also be possible to change the appearance of the bike. The main thing in trial riders is to pass the stage as quickly as possible and do not forget to do tricks as this together gives experience. The developers have also added several options for passing levels. One of the advantages is excellent physics and smooth animations. Also, the player is not offered in-game purchases. Down to number 6, Old School. It's a fun game where you will become a student and attend a schedule full of classes in time to gather the knowledge you need to succeed and take responsibility for your own behavior every step of the way. With hundreds of other students walking the halls, an equally important popularity contest challenges you to survive long enough to thrive. The game has 3D graphics and there are dozens of locations to roam inside and outside of the school. You can also fine tune the camera to enjoy the action from a variety of different angles. Also, you can choose from hundreds of preset characters of any age or you can upgrade to create your own by saving your changes to every character in the editor. Hmm. Now on number 5, Box Head, Zombie Must Die. The game offers an exciting action adventure in which you can overcome beardom and drowsiness as well as just have a great time in your free time. Players will rush around the arena location, destroy mutants, fight bosses, use the environments to their advantage, acquire new types of trunks, use special gadgets, improve the skills of the wards, and so on. And I think there are zero chances to get bored, as well as all chances to increase the speed of your reaction and improve your efficiency in making important decisions. 
After all, the enemy always comes, which requires full planning of actions in advance. Now next over at number 4, Horizon Driving Simulator. It's a racing game with a large open world, good graphics and animation, dozens of tasks and tests as well as a full-fledged development system for the entire fleet, which can be replenished with numerous car models that should be gradually improved and transformed with the help of spare parts and various tuning options for personalization. Well, convenient control with responsive behavior of technology makes the pastime very, very exciting for all fans of freedom of movement and independent choice in the direction of the vector of discovery of the presented gameplay features. So, on the third number of the list, Dear Vengeance. And folks, right now, it's time to smash the subscribe button. Anyways, Dear Vengeance is a platformer with a full-fledged and detailed plot in it, in which you can find a lot of secrets, original details, as well as a lot of strains and sometimes frightening. In any case, all this will be very, very interesting. Players will go to explore the destroyed world where there are not only riddles but also dangers and not only from falling from a height, caution, accuracy, attentiveness and constant readiness for urgent revision of immediate plans are required in the game. Sometimes it's better to run away and then come back than face to face with a critical situation. And on number 2, The Company Man. This one is a classic action platformer where you play as ever a salaryman, Zim. In the game, you will hit your crazy co-worker with a keyboard, shoot your evil bosses with emails and buff up with coffee beans at the good water company. It's a crazy game where you will put your platforming skills to the test as you jump and dash across 7 corporate departments riddled with booby traps, quirky co-workers and tough bosses. You will explore a variety of beautiful hand-painted environments and whether you are a new buy or an expert, the game got you covered with a wide range of difficulty levels from normal to impossible. Finally, at the top of the list, Resident Evil Villas. Resident Evil Village is the latest installment in Capcom's iconic survival horror franchise that has made its way to Apple Arcade, bringing its thrilling story, stunning visuals and intense gameplay to a wider audience. The game seamlessly adapts to the smaller screen of mobile devices, delivering an experience that is both captivating and accessible. Overall, it's a trump on Apple Arcade, delivering a truly terrifying and immersive experience that is both challenging and rewarding. The game's tight gameplay, captivating story and stunning visuals make it a must-play for fans of the franchise and newcomers alike. With its mobile-friendly controls and impressive performance, Resident Evil Village proves that high-quality gaming experience can indeed be enjoyed on the go. So there you have it, with so many great games to choose from, you are sure to find something that you will love. Thanks for watching and be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more gaming content. And you can leave a comment with anything about gaming, so we'll catch up in the next one, till then, happy gaming.